All our dreams have come true, right? Yeah. Uh, my great grandparents on both sides didn't see this. Was there tears? I think they were. I mean, actually, didn't you tell me what I was greeting when Hib scored the first goal. <laughs> right. Right. Okay. Right. I'm a jambo in Easter Road. Here to <laughs> Martin, come here! No, seriously. The hero for Hibs, Anthony Stokes. How you doing, mate? I'm not too bad. I think I'm better than you. The stick you're taking down this way. <laughs> um, is it sunk in yet that you won the Scottish Cup? No, I think it will when we finally sober up and uh, <laughs> it all kicks in. You know, I've always said Celtic's my club, but see after this weekend, Hibs will it'll always have a place with me. Now we you know, just unbelievable. See when David Gray connects with that header. What's the first thing going through your head? Thank <laughs> you wanted to end it there, you didn't want extra time. No, I was, genuinely I was. I, was. I remember there was an offside and I, was, yeah. I said a little prayer in my head. I was like, just please God, just let him blow this whistle. Hello, I'm here with David Gray. This is STV at Channel 6. Well, David, it's not, it's not about me. A no, it's not. Final. How's that feel, David? Well, it felt great, but it's not about me. It's about the boys, eh? I've played in. I've been involved in three cup finals now, yeah. and yesterday, <laughs> yesterday was the one that I wanted. To, I, I felt we were due to win it. I felt yesterday. Yesterday was fate. We've no won the big cup since quarter to five. <laughs> Wonderful. I will never experience another moment like that in my life until next season. <laughs> Will you be around at Easter on next year, Anthony? Um, I thought, well, I'll probably come back down for a point. <laughs> <laughs>